Hey guys, it's Cooper Manning and I'm on a quest to visit the best backyards in the country. With my friends at Barbecue Guys, we're out to discover what it means to have true backyard style and check out the sacred places where grilling magic happens. Next pit stop, the backyard of the Miz. <laughs> Hey, barbecue guys, I'm WWE superstar The Miz, and welcome to my backyard. Miz, it's hey, Koopy. How you doing, Cooper. buddy? First and Thank foremost, you. welcome to the house, but okay. you are entering a WWE superstar's house. That is not how you make an entrance. You need to make a big entrance, like the fans are roaring when you're coming in. So do it again. You want me to show you how I do it? Would you mind? Yeah, sure. So just yeah. to make you not nervous, yeah. say I'm walking in, you hear the music, you feel the crowd. You're like getting them ready, getting them ready. Maybe even do a twirl. Boom, boom, boom. Let's go! Let's go! Yeah, yeah baby! Yeah. The Miz! Barbecuing at the Miz's house. <laughs> <laughs> Let me show you around. Please, thank you. <laughs> That's the welcome I was looking for. Welcome to my backyard. Thank you, Miz. You know, we've, uh, we've it's been, awesome. Thank you, Miz. Oh, look at you. Already going there, it's huh? It's early, but Already it's awesome. Already going there. I love it. Now, what makes your backyard awesome? What do you love about it the most? Uh, just being able to spend family yeah. time here. Like, I think uh, having a big enough backyard where you can play the games that the girls love, also go in the pool, barbecue, have people over, play some music and just enjoy ourselves. I mean, that's that's what you want to do. Like this is an area where I can literally just come and just look at the beautiful view and smell the roses and just chill. Did you grow up barbecue and being in the backyard? Was that a big part of your No, view? actually, I uh, with, with my backyard, I didn't really have a backyard. I, I grew up in a condo, like a condominiums, and condominiums don't really have backyards. No. So do you think growing up not having that made you want to have this? Absolutely. I want to be able to play, I want to be able to barbecue, I want to bring people over, enjoy ourselves. Miz, this pool area is impressive, my friend. If you could have your favorite three Cleveland athletes come over and hang out for the day, who would it be? Yes, sir. Wow. These are the tough questions. Wow. They don't call me the Barbara Walters of barbecue for nothing. Okay, first we're going uh, Mark Price. Whenever I'd go to the Richfield Coliseum, because back then that's where we used to play, yes. uh, Mark Price used to light that bad boy up. And oh. man, would see something special for the Cleveland Cleveland area in general. I'd also go Bernie Kosar. Man, he, he's, he's back Cleveland. in the day, like he was Cleveland, like, and he still is. Honestly, he's still in he's Cleveland. Below. Like anytime I go to Cleveland, he's always there. Going with three, right? Yeah, maybe baseball. I mean, he rounded out the sport. Want to go baseball? Okay. Um, Jim Tomey. He's Mr. Baseball. I was doing the MLB All-Star Game, Celebrity Softball All-Star Game, right? And it was in Cleveland. So I got to play at the Jake or Progressive Field as they have it now. So I was going onto the field. I was gonna be able to play on the field. And so I get on the field and all of a sudden they're announcing everyone and they announced Jim Tomey. He's got the knee-high red socks on and he comes up to, to all of us and he goes, let's hit some dingers. And I was like, oh my God, this is awesome. Let's go. I didn't hit a dinger that day, but man, that was freaking great. Through the woods. So as you walk down through here, this right. is what we like to call the Enchanted Forest of Manor Marmiz because my daughters love Frozen. And so if you look through here, it's like you're going through the Enchanted Forest. It leads you out here to our Cinderella carriage. Oh, this is fantastic. Did you build this? Um, you know, it's a funny story how this got here. My wife was talking to someone on FaceTime. And she goes, wait a second, what's behind you? And she saw this carriage. Gotta have she it. goes, is that for sale? So she goes, buy it right now. So my wife calls me and goes, we gotta go pick it up. She's like, it's a carriage, Cinderella carriage. I'm thinking, Cinderella carriage, right? right. Like, I get there in the car and realize, oh, I need to rent a U-Haul. I go back, they were like, hey, okay, here you go, here's a wrench. I am a two-time Grand Slam champion in WWE, and I'm sitting there with a wrench, and I That's hear awesome. little kids whisper, hey, is that the Miz? <laughs> Why is he doing that to that carriage? Then when you bring it here, like, I have to bring it through this huge lawn, but they love it, the girls love it. That's all that matters. They enjoy playing in it. I'm very comfortable here. Right, it's not it's bad. A little afternoon in the, in the garden with the Miz. 
This is actually one of my favorite spots uh, because it's actually real grass. Yeah. And I get to look out there, yep, yeah, yep, yeah, see if it's windy out. Well, that's real. It's real. Not bad, yeah, huh? Not bad. No, not you bad got a grass. good fertilizer guy. Yeah, well, you know. So. It looks like a little, a great little chipping area. Like it a is little, a great little chipping area. chippy pit stop. You, you, oh, you want to have a little chippy pit I mean, stop? Yeah. All right, Cooper. Here we go. Ooh, loser yeah. cleans the grill. Loser cleans the grill. Little chippy pit stop. Let's go. Let's let's get it right in there, people. Let's get it Look right in there. Look at that. See that? That's my wife, myself, my daughters, and our TV show. And guess what? Everyone at home, you are awesome. Chippy pit stop. Ooh, okay. All right, here we go. A little chippy pit stop. Nope, not enough. I think I'm going to borrow these clubs from your wife. Pretty <laughs> good, right? Chippy oh. pit stop? Oh, yeah. Wow. Are you kidding yes, me? Yes, baby. Are you kidding me? Your second shot? <laughs> You're like, oh, I just coined this. I, just I was out here this. last I feel like night. I've been doing this all day with my wife's club. You're going to beat me. <laughs> oh, that's a good shot, though. Good form. I, I have great form. It's you just, you, you crushed me. I'm impressed though. You know what, since you won this, I'm gonna show you some championships uh, that I've actually won. I can't relate, I've never won anything. You, oh, I, you just won Chippy Pit Stop. Yeah! I mean, now let's go see some titles since you won Chippy Pit Stop. Chippy It's a new thing. Wow, that was incredible. Where are we going, Miz? So this is our billiards room, which also has uh, a lot of my prized possessions, if you will. What might those be? Those might be oh the WWE, the tag team, the United States, the Intercontinental, and of course my wife's uh, WWE Women's Championship. But yeah, these so- These are championship belts. These are championship belts. These are all titles that I have actually uh, won and held. That's actually Rey Mysterio's mask. I actually pulled that off of him. Um, in Lucha Libre, which is Mexican wrestling, these are like sacred, like your, your identity is sacred, right? So you put those on to hide your identity. Absolutely, please do. Yeah. Oh, Ray would be very I feel like proud an old football this. helmet. There you go. Oh, you can get it, you can get no it. No wonder I wasn't a very good wrestler. Let me help you, let me help you, here help you me. go. Oh, uh, is it, did oh, we get it? God, man, there you it's go. like a glove. There you go, perfect. Ah! Yeah! Weighing in at 210 pounds. <laughs> Not even close. 190 pounds. Oh, 180 bones and pounds. Six, five. It is Cooper Mandy. Welcome to the pit stop. Hello, Hi. dear. Hello. <laughs> Hi. What are we this cooking? Cooper, Hi. Cooper, Maurice, so nice Maurice to Cooper. Nice to meet you. Thanks for manning the grill today. Well, yeah, we're just doing hot dogs. Very simple. Uh, that's, that's very what I like. So, very simple. Honestly, I can mess up a hot dog. Does, Mar does Miz know what he's doing on a grill? Is he pretty good? <laughs> I know exactly what I'm doing, Cooper. <laughs> Do not uh, let I might him. be. Uh, You're not the, coming close. That's as close yeah, as you're so, going to so get. Yeah, so so let me tell you something about this grill. You know how many times I've done anything on this grill? Tell me. That many times. Don't Why? I? Because yeah. someone loves to cook. Really? Oh yeah. Yeah, my dad was a chef. I mean, that's, and I like grilling because it's healthy. That's actually how I lost all my baby weight after having my two kids. Just, just grilling. on the grill. Just, just eating a bunch of hot dogs. Yeah. Maybe not hot dogs. Vegetable, fish. You know, maybe a few hot dogs here and there. But uh, do we have cute. any hot dogs ready? Goodness. See, I'm good at eating off the grill. Are you? I'm very talented at taking a hot dog, putting it into a bun, and putting the uh, assortments on it, and then eating it. So I, I had I'm you good pegged, at this. I had you pegged for kind of a vegetarian. <laughs> Not even the least <laughs> bit. <laughs> do you need any ketchup or yeah, mustard? A little, yeah, a little something. You got, got some, some, you got some oh, treats for Maurice, us? do we have some stuff here? Yeah, it's all over there. So if we go right in this area. Woo! The one little, thing about grilling is your, uh, you can lose your eyebrows. Have you ever lost your eyebrows? I'm. I haven't lost them, but I'm willing are you, to learn. Are you a red, yellow, and then a little swirl, or are you the swirl in between? I like a or combo. Just, just a little. I, I would say like unorganized. Yeah. Unorganized. See, mine are like a little, a little organization. I like a little, a little red here and a little yellow. If you can just get a good close up of 
what I enjoy on my assortments of <laughs> hot dogs. So usually you put whatever Miz, you're I'm, I'm here. so hungry. You can't quit. You have to talk. We don't have any relish. So I would put a little relish, maybe a little chili, maybe a little cheese. But you put the red and then the yellow and then you put everything else in the middle and then you're already eating. He's already eating. All right. Oh, it's good. Big hot dogs. Very good. They're the best hot dog you've ever had in your entire life. Awesome. Great job, babe. Thank you. If you really want to figure out if these are really good, the true evaluators of a great hot dog are sitting right over there. So shall we have them test it. these out? Show me the way. Toddlers don't lie. Hey, Monroe, this is my hot dog, okay? This is my hot dog, okay? And when I close my eyes, I can't take in a take a bite, okay? All right. All right, here we go. Ready? I'm gonna eat my hot dog. <laughs> Wait! <laughs> what? Where did who bit my hot dog? Wait. Uh, who bit my did, I don't did know. you do it? No, not me. Was it you? It was not me, Miz. Show me your mouth, Cooper. Was it Cooper? I have a Wait. couple other hot dogs in there. <laughs> it was <Yeah>. you! <laughs> <laughs> Is it good, Roro? Yeah? Did mommy do a good job? Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna go play in the toys. I mean, it's clear your wife is right next to you, so grading this from a, your hot dog from a one to ten is gonna be challenging for the infinity. rest of the day. Infinity. <laughs> infinity. It's just you can tens eat hot dogs. Upon tens upon tens upon tens. Even the simplest hot dog tastes different when it comes from her. We always send our uh, our good friends home with a little bit of a. Yeah, some good looking gear right here. Barbecue yes. guys, let's go. BBQ oh, guys. And uh, we actually have a present for you. Come on. Um, it's in action figures. Oh my goodness. I have uh, a weakness for Eddie. So thank you so much for coming and, and spending some time with us. We really appreciate it. You're the best. Fun day, my friend. Good times. You are awesome. <laughs> <laughs> yes, I am. This is Cooper Manning, barbecuing with the Mizzes, and uh, we had a great day. Check us out again on Pit Stop. We won't stop now. <laughs>